So one of the things that I've been toying with and thinking about lately is the Big Bang Theory. Right? The Big Bang Theory says that everything was compressed down to a little, like, little tiny speck and then it just blew up and then everything that we have around us and we see in the James Webb Telescope and the Hubble and everything else came from that explosion. <clears throat> so one of the things that I struggle with quite a bit because I grew up in a very religious household, I was raised Southern Baptist in the Christian community, and I've I've kind of you know I moved myself away from that uh, later on in life. But one of the things I struggle with quite a bit is the idea that what if that Big Bang, that explosion that sparked off everything, was the firing of a thought? What if thought is the building block of our existence? And what is thought but data? So data is the building block of our existence. So if thought sparked off, the firing of the neuron of the cosmic consciousness sparked off and created everything that we know, that means something had that thought. Something bigger than any of us had that thought. Is that a godlike entity? And so got me it really, because of my upbringing, I really process and have to deal with what does that mean? I have pretty much rejected the notion of a god, but yet here I am coming to this conclusion that it might actually be some sort of god type entity. Now, the, the thing that reject, that I caused me to reject, though, about God was I didn't like the idea that something, a being, an entity, whatever you want to call it, was in control of or influence of my life. That I wasn't in control of the actions and the course that my life takes. So, I think that I can process or accept that there could be something bigger than me that sparked off this thought that created everything that we know that also is not God. Because we all have thoughts every day, and we see those thoughts come to fruition, right? I thought about making this video, and I did. But everything that this video touches or influences from this point going forward, I'm not God of that thing or that outcome or that instance or that occurrence. But my thought brought it into existence. So this cosmic consciousness, if you will, that had this thought that brought us all into existence isn't necessarily God. But we are the result of thought. And our life, lives, are defined by the expression of thought. And that just has a nice, harmonious ring to it, in my opinion. 